If you need to keep samples cool out in the field whilst doing sampling in remote locations, you're gonna to wanna to stay tuned for this. Hi, I'm Andre from the John Morris Group, and if you don't wanna miss any of our regular content, please click that subscribe button and that little bell right next to it, and it'll let you know as soon as we upload new content. Today, we're looking at the Avalanche Sampler from ISCO. Now, this is a beautiful little sampler, and it's quite unique. The thing I really like about this is that it's the only sampler which is both portable and refrigerated. And not only is it refrigerated, but it can operate off a range of different power conditions, that is AC and DC power. Right out of the box, it comes with a number of handy little attachments. You've got an AC power cord so that you can plug it straight into your 240 volts, or in America, you've got a 110 volt version. It also comes with these handy little alligator clips here, which plug into the back of the unit and enable you to run it off a 12 volt battery. You will need a car battery or a deep cycle truck battery to run it because refrigeration takes quite a bit of energy. Or you can also plug it directly into the cigarette lighter of a vehicle and run it in the back of your truck, for instance. This sampler can take up to 14 bottles, or it can also be a composite bottle solution with a single poly bottle or glass bottle for that matter. When you run with the multiple bottle solution, it looks a lot like this. So you have a container and the 14 bottles simply sit in directly like this. And these are poly bottles, just under one litre. We normally supply it with a strainer and a suction line, and that connects directly up to the pump tubing on the sampler over here. This unit features the 6712 head. Now the 6712 head is a very versatile head unit. And what we really love about it is that you can plug a flow meter directly into the side here, a 700 series flow meter. Or on the back here, you have a number of different options. You can plug in your own external flow meter from a different brand. You could plug in a, a rain gauge or a liquid level actuator. And it's also got an internal memory, so it will store all of the data that it records when you took the sample, any errors, any sensors that you have. Did I mention this device will also take SDI-12 sensors? So that could be a sonde, uh, for instance, that might allow you to do multiple parameters. And it'll, if you do use any of those things, it'll actually store all of the data on here, and then you can export it via a cable to your computer and upload that for, for viewing. We regularly sell these units with a, a cart, which makes them very portable very easy to wheel around, very transportable, and on the front of the cart is a space for you to put your 12 volt deep cycle battery. To open the unit up, undo the clips, so the one here and one there, and you can see here I've pre-assembled the distributor arm, but you could also have a single bottle configuration, and in that case it would plonk in directly in the middle. You've got a fan inside here to distribute the cool air, and there's also a temperature sensor inside to make sure that the unit is running at the right temperature. On the bottom of the bottle kit, you'll notice there's a little groove which helps you to align the bottle kit in exactly the right position, and that makes sure that you're always gonna get the right sample in the right bottle. Like all ISCO samplers, it's also got the liquid sensing device uh, here underneath the sampling tube. And what that does is it tells the sampler exactly when the liquid is coming up through the suction line and passes this point. And by doing that, the sampler knows when it's actually pumping real liquid, not just air. And it also can help it to accurately measure and dispense the volume that you've got set in the controller. So we have the Avalanche samplers operating in a range of environmental conditions here in Australia and New Zealand, from the hot, dry climates of Western Australia to the monsoonal climates of far north Queensland and the Northern Territory, right the way through to the colder climates of New Zealand and Tasmania. And the reason that our customers love them so much is because they are sequential or composite, plus you have a range of power options and you can literally move these things around from day to day, week to week, and activate them based upon any kind of external event, whether it's time-based, flow-based, level-based, or your own sensor or configuration or signal that you want to actually actuate the sampler. 
So that's the portable automatic water sampler from ISCO, the Avalanche. If you found this content helpful, don't be shy to give us a thumbs up and of course, share it with somebody who you think might enjoy this content. So if you have any questions about this or indeed anything else from our range, don't be shy, leave a comment in the section below and our team will get right back to you. Don't forget, John Morris is here to help you succeed with technology. Thanks so much for watching and bye for now.